Okay, team. <clears throat> team Ath. I don't know where to look. I don't know where my camera, the camera thing is. But the very first thing that I do is I just kind of do a brush. Brush through, see what's going on. You can see I have, you know, some sparseness like through here. There's like some holes. Um, I get my brows. It's called laminated, so they're um, they put this solution in them that relaxes them so that you can really brush them all around. And especially if you have coarse and curly brows like I do, it's really helpful. So this is the um, Hourglass Brow Sculpting Pencil in Warm Brunette. And all I do is I just kinda, I'm, I'm, it's a light touch. It's a light touch to just kind of fill in those areas that I have some sparseness. Okay. That looks pretty good to me. And then I'll kind of what you're doing is you're like creating a little shadow behind the brow. So you're really getting into like, make sure you're getting onto the skin, right? Also do the same over here. This is really hard to do in the phone. This is my first tutorial. Thanks for coming to my channel. So I just kind of go like that. Again, you're just kind of creating that like, and then if I like, see how I did that line a little harsh, I just kind of with my finger, creating that shadow made look kind of wild. So then I'll brush back through. I mean, I have a lot of brow to deal with, so. Um, this is the Anastasia brow brush. And then this is the Kosa's medium brown gel, which I really like. So what I like about the lift is that I can really do those sprouts like that. I have pretty dark eyebrows, but I like using a shade lighter so that they're not too crazy. So I could just kind of, for the ladies that don't have a lot of brow, one technique is to hold your brow like tight like that and then really get in there and back comb the fibers of your hairs. I don't really need that. I mean, unless I was gonna go crazy, which is sometimes fun. Okay, and so then I just kinda, this is, this is the finished look. Oh God, 